What's up, deputies? Officer, first 30 minutes here. Today we are in this ridiculous police car. A lot of you guys have been requesting I use more supercars in my patrol. So today we are using one. This is the Audi R8 LMS Pursuit Edition by Bizzle ZX10R. Look at this thing. Absolutely ridiculous. Even has a grill guard on it, and it's so low to the ground that grill guard's essentially scraping the ground as I go. But uh, today we're going to be patrolling around Los Santos, the city area. We'll take callouts. Um, hopefully, we get a couple of speed pursuit callouts. That would be nice to make use of this vehicle. So let's see if we can open up the trunk to get our gear. I'm not sure if it'll work on this model or not. All right, it sure does work. Engines in the back on a car like this. Absolutely crazy. It's going to be a crazy episode. And let's go ahead and make ourselves available for calls. We are 10-8. Attention unit 1, Lincoln 18. We have a 505 on um, Del Perro Freeway. Units respond code 3. Lincoln 18, copy that. She was 1076. We're headed en route to a speed pursuit. First call of the day. Suspect's vehicle is pretty far away. Oh, I'm going to scrape the crap out of this car. So we're going to see if we can catch up. See where they're headed. They're actually headed back towards this way. Take the purple route. Might get us there a little bit quicker. Yeah, this thing is absolutely ridiculous. Of course, no police department in real life outside of maybe Dubai is going to have a vehicle quite like this as part of their fleet. It's, it's just too crazy. I can't... The maintenance cost on a vehicle like this, a supercar in general, is just outrageous on its own. A lot of police vehicles you'll find have very low maintenance costs. And that's a good thing because police departments use the heck out of these vehicles and they need cheap parts keep them running this guy is absolutely flying we're still not gaining much ground on him I don't know if he's in a motorcycle or not but he's going at a high rate of speed Got a visual on suspect. Looks like they're in a gauntlet headed eastbound now on Power Street. Let's go ahead and get some backup in here. Air support as well. Go ahead and notify Highway Patrol too. Speeds at about 70 miles per hour. Eastbound on Interstate 4. Suspect just evaded a unmarked police cruiser. Might try a pit maneuver. Let's go ahead and request a pit. Oh, we've been granted to a uh, pit performance, <laughs> but uh, accidentally already hit him. So we got S A H P joining us in this pursuit. Still eastbound U.S. Route 15. We're running into a good amount of traffic up here. Let's, let's watch Highway Patrol attempt another pit. Oh, vehicle just went into oncoming traffic. He's had it uh, eastbound still into oncoming traffic. He actually has an advantage here because it doesn't look at, like uh, that side of the interstate quite as nearly as busy. Again, again, caught up here. All right. Looks like units might have them stopped here. Let's go ahead and get over here and block them off. Oh yeah, just run into the supercar. Out of the vehicle, driver. Out of the vehicle right now, you're under arrest. All right, hands are in the air. It looks like he's gonna be giving up here. I'm gonna move into cough. Please, no other drivers hit me. Nobody panic. Nobody panic. Okay, Tom Linford. We've got him in custody. Lincoln 18, show one in custody. Roger. You'll kill somebody. Okay, let's go ahead and pat him down. Attention all East Los Santos units. Make sure you don't have anything on you, Tom. In Mirror Park. 
Okay, we're gonna have to do a little bit of traffic management here. Close nearby roads. Let's get transport out here. Charlie four, roger that. While we clean this up. Alright, Tom, you just have a seat. We also need to search his name. See if he had any warrants out. Tom Winford. Found license, no 1099s. Okay, transport vehicle should be on the way. Let's go ahead and search his car real quick. See if anything's in here. Shit. Yeah, my uh, Audi got beat up pretty good there. I would hate to estimate the amount of damage that was caused during this pursuit, but it's probably significant. All right, that's one way to get transport here. Just uh, spawn in. All right, looks like he uh, despawned both of our vehicles. So we'll have to get a uh, dispatch to get us a new Audi R8. We're gonna be code four off of this call out. Dispatch to all South Los Santos units. Officers report in Chamberlain Hills. One out of 18. Respond code three. Got a stolen vehicle spotted in the area. It's going to be this burrito, this work van. Let's go ahead and pull him over. All right, looks like he's going to be fleeing. Dispatch to the Lincoln 18. Show us in pursuit. Got a stolen burrito on the loose. We're going to get a uh, license check on this vehicle. Yep, coming back is stolen. It's confirmed stolen. Vehicle is not stopping. This might be it right here. He might be stuck in traffic. Oh, nope, he's driving around this cola truck. So we're headed westbound Davis Avenue, speed to about 30 miles per hour. He's getting off on this exit ramp onto where are we headed. Oh, what a maneuver there. Looks like Pitt has been authorized. Let's see if he's gonna drive. Oh, shots fired, shots fired. Shots fired. Alright, both drivers are, are dead. Wow, what a crazy turn of events. Had my gun out there. Trying to get them to stop. Okay, come on through, crazy person. Okay. Alright, come on, guys. I'm gonna use my car to block off the street here. We got two fatalities. I think roadway should be closed anyway. Let's uh, put down a few cones here. I believe the scene is secure, so let's go ahead and get EMS out here too. All units, we've got medical aid requested in Porta. All right, hopefully they get the picture here with these cones. Yeah, that was crazy. I had to discharge my weapon. Uh, I got shot actually one time, but body armor absorbed it. Got two dead here. EMS is on the way to uh, check them out, but I'm pretty sure they're they're both dead. They have actually stolen this. This is a work van here. Looks like um some propane company. So EMS is trying to get here. Oh, what are you doing, buddy? No, 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 no. Get out of the vehicle. Get out of the vehicle right now. Stupid. Stop, All right, man, please. you're under arrest for trying to steal my vehicle. I, I hate when AI try to do that. It's so annoying. This place is crazy as hell. All right, I'm just gonna get transport out here. EMS is gonna check, check these guys out. Nothing much. Stop, Porta. You Copy that, dick. dispatch. Animals on the loose. Right, just right, sit on the ground. Whoa. Whoa. There's a transport van. 
All right, guys. What what's the uh, what's the word here? Do I need to pull these out for you? <laughs> Paramedic didn't know that the dead body was in there. Yeah, we got two dead. Oh my gosh. I can't even see. This gets so crazy. I hate stopping people on these busy roads. The paramedics are like, screw this, I'm out. Let's get the corner out here. Go ahead and clean this scene up. The longer we stay here, the more problems the game starts throwing at us. Found a Bible in the engine. Good to know. We'll just walk over this dead body here. No worries. Some used condoms. Okay. What else we got? I don't think we can go back there. And then let's do the driver's side. Then we're getting this thing towed out. Corner should be here shortly. Yeah, binoculars. Alright. Tow truck's coming, corner's coming. This scene's gonna be clear. We're gonna clean up the cones and continue our patrol. Dispatch calling unit one, Lincoln, 18. Citizens report a possible burglary in Strawberry. Respond code two. Proceed with caution. Got a possible burglary in the area. League in 18 shows 1076. We're gonna check this out. Respond code two. A lot of people have been questioning what uh, code two means. According to, oh, I hear a siren going off. All right, we're gonna investigate this area here. It's coming from the gas station. 10-4. Oh, I guess it was a false alarm. Nothing around the location. Anyway, let me pull into the gas station here and explain it. Code 2 for LAPD is just going to be urgent driving. No lights and no siren. So I know some people who play LSPD FR, Code 2 to them is lights only. Well, that's fine. But we're trying to go off what LAPD uses since that's what Los Santos is based off of. And according to them, Code 2 is simply just urgent driving. Now sometimes I'll kind of alter that to include lights to get somewhere a little bit quicker so the video isn't too boring. But other than that, Code 2 means urgent driving. We have a possible disturbance in Rockford Hills. Respond code two. All right, we're gonna respond code two to a possible burglary silent alarm call. Silent alarm is just means someone's tripped the alarm, but there's no audible sound. So we're gonna be responding code two. Looks like it's up on Vinewood Hills out of residence. So we will go and see what's going on. Remember that the suspect does not yet know the police have been called. So we're not gonna have our um, lights or sirens on. We don't want to trip them off to anything. Oh, did, what's going on here? Looks like we have a pursuit. I see somebody walking right here. We've got an unrelated pursuit going on. This guy's kind of bailing it. What's going on here, man? Yep, we got a... Uh, All right, what is going on here? Oh, we got shots fired. This guy's trying to attack me. Somebody's shooting at me. Actually, I think he might be unrelated to the call, even though he's pretty suspicious. There's somebody in this residence over here. All right, we need backup here immediately. Let's investigate this. I believe this is the resonance. Gonna move in here. Oh yeah, we got somebody hiding behind the street, armed. I'm reloading. Okay. Making sure this seems secure. We got a, a woman panicking in her bikini over here. I'm pretty sure that was very traumatic to see. Yeah, this guy's down. All right, so what we're gonna do is, um, I'm gonna check the pulse here. 
Yep, he is confirmed dead, so coroner's going to be called. We won't even bother with the EMS. Corner's gonna come, take pictures, and we're gonna clean this scene. Let's put up a couple barriers, maybe. So, have a problem with onlookers. I did call police backup. That's uh, this other officer who is on scene. I got shot once or twice, but once again, that body armor definitely saved me. Corners are taking pictures through the bushes. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Yep, there's our backup. All right. He's saying he's getting too old for the job. Scene is gonna be clear. Unfortunately, you did not find a piece of evidence or collect a piece of evidence. Actually, I did not know I was supposed to collect evidence on this one. I guess I was probably supposed to walk around the, the house a little more. We'll do that here and just see if anything looks out of place before we leave. But a silent alarm was triggered back here. a station emergency. Multiple officers down in the Spooshy Canal. Code 99. She is just chilling. Yeah, I'm not I'm not seeing anything anywhere. On standby. No signs of any weapons or anything laying around. All windows look intact. No doors are busted down. So that one, this one's going to be code for, and I'm going to conclude the patrol for today. I hope you guys did enjoy this episode. If you want to see more of this Audi R8, definitely let me know. Leave me a comment. Of course, I'm always looking for just suggestions on locations to patrol and cars to use. So I got, I definitely want to hear from you guys. All right, guys, I'll see you on the next patrol.